Okay, what's next? Let's do... Um... I was gonna go somewhere, right? Yeah, that's right. Resources! That's right. Okay. Uh. Let's see where I wanted to go. Okay, let me just take... Uh, I definitely need copper and iron. Okay, let me see. If there are crates here... Oh, wait, why is there a... Wait, are you here already? I just- I need to see this. Hold on. Be a deer. <laughs> yeah, it'd be nice something to eat. Okay. I don't know what you like. Let me give you coffee. I gave you coffee and you're eating a sandwich. That makes no sense. <laughs> okay, I still don't know what any of your likes or dislikes are. I wonder how you are. Oh, you're hungry too. Burnt food? Oh no. Let's give you tea. Yes. I love that he's like, not picky at all. I don't understand why that... Okay. Let's go to the bus stop. <laughs> Okay, copper and iron ore. Uh, what else? Improvements. Okay, so it was copper, iron... Yes, copper ore, iron ore. Yep. Okay, okay, that's what I need. What if other places can improve? Like, can this improve? Nope. Okay. That's fine. Almost there. Hmm, soon I know that Astrid is gonna be asking- Oh, hello. Oh, you hungry? Let me give you what you gave us, rice pudding. I really love dessert of all kinds. <laughs> Thanks a lot, Stella. Nice. She loves dessert? All right, bus guy. Okay, now. Oh. Why? Why do I go there? <laughs> Okay, you know what I'm thinking? Oh, what's this? Whoa, what are these? Oh, the lighthouse. Whoa, what is it? I think that was the some sort of jump thing. So I can't go there yet. But from here, let's go here. Ceramic bowl randomly in the ocean. Okay. <laughs> eh, almost there. Almost there. Yep, here we are. Let's go. Yo. 
Oh, this place. <sighs> How hard I've tried to, like, get to that thing. <laughs> Actually, maybe I haven't. <gasps> Yay! Okay, cool. I Old carpet, are you freaking serious? <laughs> oh, you're here. <laughs> I'm picking up some ore. Okay. <laughs> yes, you love that stuff. And mushrooms. This one. Nice. Oak log. Oh my god, strawberries. A lot of resources here, actually. I definitely need iron. Oh, that's okay. Oh. Nice. What was that? Limestone? Great. <laughs> so Perfect. Okay. Can I need iron? I see these mushrooms and I think they're I can pick them. Oh, look at all these trees. <laughs> okay. Let's go. Oh, resource mining. Okay, next destination. Hmm. Let's go here. New place! Oh my gosh. Don't forget, he's gonna be talking about those. <laughs> the fried chicken! Yes, I know. I need to find chicken. And then I can cook it. Quest. Oh! Yep. Let's go see the letter. Oh, hey. Nice. Astrid, while the two of us caught up on the latest gossip, I forgot to give you something. I found this while flipping the magazines, and it made me think of you. It definitely fits your style and panache. Also, I heard a rumor your husband could be in... <laughs> Excuse me. <laughs> Iwashima Countryside. Might be worth checking it out. I'll keep asking around just in case, your old friend Olga. So... I found this. What is it? What's this? Okay. Mm -hmm. A letter you say from Olga? Mm -hmm. This is so nice of her. Olga had news about Gio- Oh! <laughs> Iwashima countryside, mm -hmm. you say? Oh, okay. We should probably go take mm -hmm. a look. And what? An inspiration? For a house? For me? <laughs> How thoughtful. Okay, cool. Perfect. Can't deny it. Olga knows me so well. Yes, indeed. I would be very happy to have such a nice den to live mm -hmm. in. It's always pleasant to know someone is thinking about me. I mean, you could have thought about this yourself, of course. But don't worry, I know you're very busy, mm -hmm. Munchkin, being the spirit bearer. It's okay, I won't regret you. What does that mean? <laughs> and I know you. You'll build this nice cabin aboard as soon as you can. You're so resourceful, after all. Thanks a lot, Stella. Can't wait. Alright, we're gonna go to this place. 
this I feel like I keep going to places like before I should be going, but it's fine. Let's go. rock from a friend. He said that if you stand next to it for like a week, you can become a seagull or something. <laughs> what? Mm. I don't get it. I've been here for days. Everyone here says that they feel something. Mm. I don't feel anything. What gives? I shouldn't have quit my job! <laughs> oh, brother. Mm. When the others aren't looking, I like to lick the rock. What? <laughs> Helps me concentrate. Also, it's a little bit salty. Strawberries. Let's get those. Oh! Yep. Another tree. Nice. Oak log. Mushrooms. And then, ooh, it's here. Oh, that's it? Sandy Island. Swim. Yeah, that's it. Oh, so pretty. Hey. Huh. Oh. I wonder if we have to do anything with this rock later. Hmm. We'll see. Said back. Iwashima countryside, huh? Giovanni's location? Ugh, too dark. Okay. Time to sleep? This crow's end ink. Okay, I feel like I shouldn't go there yet. Ah, uh, the lighthouse. I feel like I need to go. Where is it? Let's see, I don't even know what some of these things are. Where is it? Oh my gosh, I was freaking there. It'll be faster if I just like, went to the bus stop. <coughs> oh, another thing. Furugawa tours. Ooh. Oh, I always do that. Okay. Greetings from Furugawa. Experience the wonders of the great outdoors. You can now take a tour of the city, see the shops, visit our shrine, take in the sights. Available now in Furugawa. Oh, cool. Have I been there? I feel like I've been there. Either way, we can go. They're still sleeping. Time to wake up. <laughs> I love that sound. Oh, you know what? I have like some things now. Oh, you know, let's just take the bus first and then maybe do that stuff. Mostly because I really don't like the 
this music. Oh, it drives me nuts. Okay, let's go. Iwashima countryside. <laughs> I think it's like literally just there. Okay. Now let's check on the oh, improvements. Let's improve. Oh, well, we need glass for her, so I know for her. Yep, see? Now I can do that. Still need aluminum and glass. But I'm glad I was able to get her. Yay! See, she's like wondrous. Okay. Wondrous! Oh, you're spoiling me, Stella. What an incredible piece of furniture. It livens the room so much, so much cozier now. Filled to the room with clothes and accessories, too. Oh, it was pretty nice. You don't know how happy that makes me. Well, what are you waiting for? Jump out of these old, dirty clothes. Pick something with some chest. <gasps> Wait, are you saying I can change my outfit? <laughs> I'm so excited. <laughs> okay. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. Why? Why am I so excited? Okay, I can only choose those colors now, though. Vanilla. So does that mean... Oh... Yes. Interesting choice, excuse me. Ooh. Okay, I don't know which... Oh, maybe the yellow boss is nice. Oh no. <laughs> Why did I do that? Okay, let's go with those shoes. Mustard? I like the teal. The hat? What if it was a different... Is it too different? Yeah, I think the gold. What interesting choice. Well, that certainly is a modern choice. Excuse me. <laughs> Very useful. What about something more, um, classic? I think there was a nice periwinkle outfit in the bottom drawer. Try it on. Ooh, periwinkle outfit. Fantastic. Oh, sweetie, isn't that so much better? Hmm, I don't know. I like the teal stuff. <laughs> Why you look so adorable? I could just eat you up. There's plenty more for you to try on. Don't be shy. Come over anytime. I always love doing these little fashion shows with my granddaughter. Oh no! Here we go! Learning more about these people! Oh, what is it? You found an envelope on the bottom of the drawer? How peculiar! Oh, don't make me wait and open it. What is it you say? Pictures and letters? Those are mine. How did they ever end up here? What a mystery. Look! This is my husband's handwriting! <laughs> oh, it's messy, alright. He never was a delicate man, but quite handy and so very loving. And would you look at that? My backyard! See all these trees? Sweet Eugene planted a tree for every one of our children. And then for our grandchildren. Oh my god. We grew apples, cherries, pears. I remember my granddaughter playing in her mother's apple tree. Such sweet memories. Look at me rambling again. Go ahead. Sweetheart, I won't hold you back any longer. Oh my gosh. Okay, well, I liked what I had on though. <gasps> oh, that's kind of cool. <laughs> oh, so I can do the lavender blouse now. With. Oh, let's see, let's see. Teal, powder, plum, mustard. <gasps> Oh my gosh. Let's do this, let's do this, let's do this. Okay. Maybe I should do this one. And then... This one. <laughs> Babe, look at my Lakers outfit. <laughs> 
Oh my god, yeah, that's right. <laughs> Leaker's outfit. Ah, it's so funny. Okay, we're here, I think. I have something for you. Yes, give me stuff. I bake something for the crew. Oh, yes. Rice pudding and apple pie. Oh, yeah. You, you're probably hungry. Yeah, you're hungry. Oh, no, you don't. Oh, it's because you're working. Are you hungry? Oh, you're hungry. Might as well give you what you gave. Like, come on. Apple pie. <laughs> she loves it. Okay, what about, uh... Astrid. Good morning. You are maybe hungry. You're mm -hmm. Thank you. Okay, I still don't know what they like. We're here. Let's see if he's around. <laughs> Are you hungry? Let's do this. Okay. Mm -hmm. Olga said in her letter that Giovanni could have been around. Knowing him as I do, I have my doubts. He wouldn't linger mm -hmm. in a place like this, but who knows. Maybe if you ask around, we might find a clue or two. I'll leave you to it. I don't want to mm -hmm. go too far. The humidity here is killing me. Go, go. I trust you'll find interesting stuff. Okay, I guess we're going to talk to these people. Mm -hmm. Who? I don't remember his name. That night didn't call for names, if you know what I mean. Excuse me. <laughs> I do remember his legs, though. Oh, brother. Wait. He has a wife? He didn't say anything about it. He did say he was going to Furogawa. Well, if you ever meet with him, tell him tell him that Eileen misses him. Oh, God. <laughs> Why did that immediately? This is the life. Oh, okay, you're still on that. He was here, you say, and he met someone? No. Don't tell me. I don't want to know. Oh, oh my gosh. This is... <sighs> okay. Mm -hmm. okay, maybe I do. But just a tiny bit. Only where he mm -hmm. went. Furugawa, you say. I think I know where that is. I've heard it's a lovely mm -hmm. place. Well, at least that's what the brochure mm -hmm. said. I've always loved those colorful flyers. They make you travel without leaving mm -hmm. your seat. All right, Munchkin, let's check it out. Okay, let's do this. This is kind of fun. It's like a detective journey. <laughs> Try to find this person. Hey, that guy's at my place. Oh, quartz. Nebula fabric. Bright jelly. Okay, same stuff. As last time, pretty much. Okay. Dang it. What else is there? Maybe... I might have some stuff that I might like. No, not really. Okay. <laughs> okay, Furugawa. Okay, I was gonna say, I better not be where I've been. Oh, is it this one? Oh, it is. Okay. How far is it? Bus stop. Let's do that. Goodness. Mm. Aluminum still. Glass. Okay. I bet, like, one of these, like, new places I'm gonna go to is gonna have some of this stuff. Iron ingot. Okay. Might as well do the iron. Mm. Oh, I'm almost at the bus stop, though. Let's do that first. Let's 
Hmm. Ah, still one shrine up okay, that's fine. That's the one I can like, I'm like, I was trying to jump to and I was having trouble. Oh, where's that? What's her face? Furugawa? I thought there was something about house. Oh god, did I like forget that? Oh, you have to build the bungalow? Oh my god, I'm such a fool. Oh well, let me do this thing then, since I'm in Furugawa. Okay, this is interesting. <laughs> or even Al, this key champ, you know, Al, mm -hmm. but, but Giovanni, mm -hmm. Giovanni. Whatever I did, whatever happened, he always made me smile. His eyes looked like shooting stars, his hair smelled like morning dew, but enough mm -hmm. of this. Daydreaming won't get us nowhere. Let's do something productive. Aren't your crops in need of water? I have planted nothing. Ugh, I can't believe I came here and I wasn't supposed to come here yet. Forgot about her house thing. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. <laughs> this peculiar mix of musk and nonchalance. Mm -hmm. Must have been here recently, quick munchkin. Let's ask around. Oh. Giovanni, that name. Don't say that name. He almost broke up my marriage. Who is this person? <laughs> came here a month ago. Big man, thinking he's the oh. boss. Good thing my wife came to her senses. He apparently didn't like the weather. Good riddance. Oh man, okay, so he left. What a bust. Mm -hmm. Sorry, Stella, I... Ugh, damn it. Enough is enough, I'm done wasting my time. I won't be looking for that hoodlum anymore. Mm -hmm. I don't need him to be happy. I don't need to hear stupid jokes and incessant yammering. I don't need him to be suffocated by his mm -hmm. floral cologne. I don't need to have him constantly showering me with praise. I don't need to see his flamboyant mane. I don't. Mm -hmm. I... Let's go back to the boat, Munchkin. Well, alright. Okay, okay, building her bungalow. Wait, there must be something- other stuff- like, are there resources that I haven't- Oh, visit the art collector, right? Uh-huh. Ah, oh, you're back. Did you manage to get the missing print? No, it was uh -huh. already sold, but how? Wait, is there a competing art collector roaming about? A walrus lady, uh -huh. you say? Of course, of course it was her. That horrid woman, that dim-witted, egotistical, patronizing charlatan. She calls herself the Collector, if you can believe it. She doesn't even collect anything. Oh, I'm sure she bought the print only to spite me. Should have never told her about my collection, that ugly ass sack face. Uh -huh. Well, I'm not one to wave away competition. The ugly witch is in hiding. In hiding from uh -huh. you. I don't specifically know why, but the news of a new spirit fairer made her skitter away like a puny cockroach. A fitting. Yes, yes, you're the uh -huh. spirit fairer. Tell me something I don't know. She should have known better than to tell me the location of her hideout, though. She's hiding at these coordinates. Uh -huh. Oh, okay. When you see her shore, this figurine, she'll know. Believe me, she'll know. Uh -huh. <laughs> this- oh, do not worry, it's just some junk Theodore gave me. Ceramic figurine. Okay, I guess I have another... The art collecting. Travel to Susan's museum. Negative 150, 150. Okay. Uh, let's see if I have something else. Oh, visitor! Woo. 
Welcome to the world-renowned Furugawa Tours. The tour will begin shortly. It takes about five minutes and covers the rich history of the city. After you'll have so many anecdotes about this place, you'll be the life of the party if you ever attend one. Ready? Mm. Let's just do it. Yeah, except they mistreat their workers. <laughs> oh wait, I think I'm thinking of a different thing. Raccoon ink. Hmm, I don't know. Oh my gosh, what is wrong with me? Let's do it. Alright, what did I get? A signed vintage poster. Cool. place. Dark to navigate. All right, so it looks like Giovanni is not where we thought he would be. So we're gonna build Astrid her house. Let's do it. Let's do it. Astrid's bungalow, slate and linen fabric. Nice, I can build it. Dang, it's big. What the heck? Why is it so freaking huge? Okay, you know what? I'm just gonna put it here for now. 
I'm gonna start like moving these because there's a lot more room. I always liked having these at the edge. And then like I don't know, I liked having I wanna have the kitchen like somewhere else. Feels old, so let's put her to the bottom. <laughs> Isn't that weird? Okay, everything is so oddly placed now. so oddly placed. Okay. Okay. Let's do that for now. Wow, there's so much room now. <laughs> Let's see what else I can build. I still need to do the orchard. Where is that? Ah, oh, nebula thread. Oak plank. Okay, wow, I'm so glad I built that. What's next up on our list of tasks? Oh, I still need glass. Talk to Astrid. There you are. Stella, you've got to be kidding me. This house is just fantastic. You know, I love simple things. Simple things that make me feel good and warm inside. What can I say? I don't like when it's too complicated or luxurious. <laughs> you have like one of the biggest houses here. I just don't. That's who I am. I've always been like that as far as I remember. When I was young, many of my friends were pretty rich and famous. Mm -hmm. You know, artists, philosophers, sports athletes, athletes. I've always attracted the finest people. What can I say? Oh, God. But it didn't mean a thing back then, and it still doesn't to this day. Aw. Mm -hmm. That's probably why I ended up marrying Jiva. Oh, they were married? I mean, I know earlier, it's. I guess it didn't click. Like, I know one of the characters said, like, um, he has a wife, but he's just didn't think about it. I think that was just them assuming something, but oh my gosh, they were married. He was so simple, yet so elegant, so genuine, but also fun and unpretentious, mm -hmm. and he didn't have a dime to his name. Still doesn't, I guess. Mm -hmm. Okay, I've got to admit, I think I miss him. I know I shouldn't. I know he's worthless riffraff. Mm -hmm. I know he probably doesn't give a shit about me now, but, but I just can't mm -hmm. forget about him. Hey, Mushkin, do you think you could check the mail? Maybe... Olga has written to us about him, as she said she would. I would be so grateful mm -hmm. if you did. Thanks a lot, Stella. I won't forget this. Okay. Let's go check the mail. Oh. Oh, okay. Mail. 
Astrid big in news. You'll be glad to know that my sources have finally panned out. I heard my sister Masha might know something about your husband's whereabouts. You should go and drop in on her. Okay. 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 I think that we are going to leave it. Oh, wait. Hold on. Okay. Stella. I've heard we received another letter from Olga. Masha, you say? She's her sister. She might know something about Giovanni's location. Huh, okay. Good. Let's go talk to her then. She is... how to put it... special? Me and her... let's say we've never been friends. It's so great. And Stella, thanks for playing messenger. You're wonderful. Oh yay! Okay, so I think the next thing that we have to do is visit Masha on this journey to find Astrid's husband, Giovanni. But I think for now, we are gonna leave it off. Um, this has been really fun, just trying to like find out where her husband is. This is so wild. <laughs> um, anyway, again, love this game so far. It's really cool to see all these different character stories just slowly, slowly, slowly pan out. I know that for, uh, what is her name? This character over here, who lives in this house. Oh my gosh, what is her name? She talked a little bit about her family. Um, I still need to get fried chicken for uncle, so need to do that. So when when that happens, I'm sure more of his story is going to show up too. But it's been really fun getting to learn about them. Oh, going to leave it off for now. Hopefully next time we're actually going to meet Giovanni. Uh, so don't forget to like, subscribe, all that good stuff. And until next time... Isang Bagsak.